I am going to make a bean bag for a doll using fabric, thread, needles, and some kind of filler, whether it's beans, rice, or even scraps, and a piece of paper. For a larger doll, you might want to use newspaper. I start by folding my paper over, I lay my doll on top, and then mark where the top of her head is. I cut out a curved shape that is the same length as her body, and I now have a pattern. You can adjust your pattern to make them bigger, smaller, wider, or thinner. I cut five out of fabric. Take two, lay them good side to good side. Using a needle and thread or a sewing machine, begin stitching down one side. And remember to lock your stitch in the beginning. And you're just going to do a straight stitch all the way down the edge. This is a great opportunity to work on your hand stitching. When you get to the end, just open it up, take the next piece, lay it good side to good side, line it up with your edge, and begin stitching it just as before. And then add the next one and the next one until all five pieces are sewn together. Now I'm going to continue my stitching, but I'm only going to go a third of the way on each side so that I leave an opening in the middle. And I'm going to add a few stitches at the ends just to make sure they're closed. Flip it right side out. Fill it with the filling of your choice. For a larger doll, I'm going to use scraps instead of rice or beans just to cut down on the cost. Use a needle and thread to stitch the opening closed. Trim off the excess. And you're done. Happy crafting! Do you like to take photos of your doll crafts? Well, yeah, who doesn't? Did you know you can share them with us on Facebook for a chance to be in one of our videos? Just submit your photo in the same place that you would leave a comment. You can even Photoshop your own website onto the picture. It's like getting free advertising for you. See you on the next video. Where do I get my ideas from? Well, it usually starts like this. I head over to my computer. They want me to make what? Well, okay. Then I head on over to a little store in the middle of the old noggin shopping center called Trial and Error. It's only the best place to find creativity. You know I'm being sarcastic, right? And that there is no real store. I just keep working at it until I get it right. And it's not impossible for two people to come up with the same idea. Haven't you ever heard the saying, great minds think alike? But it is our goal to make fun and easy crafts as original as possible. Hello everybody! You have missed me, no? I mean, how could you not? I am Naveen. Oh, will you just get out of the way? Nobody steals my spotlight. Chloe, you ready to do this? Yeah, I'm coming. We want to get a shout out to... Bratz Girl Sweetie 231. What's up? Alright, yeah, you did good this time. Sophie. I'm just saying, you did. <laughs>